think we can all agree that this past week has been a little strange. It's currently day one of our nationwide lockdown, which is set to go on for another four weeks at least. For me personally, life at the moment seems quite surreal, and all my intentions for Lent have just gone out the window. I mean, how can I be expected to stay focused on Lent and preparing for Easter with all this other stuff going on? It won't even feel like Easter without the usual masses and liturgies over Holy Thursday, Good Friday and Easter Sunday. To top it all off, the Gospel for this Sunday tells of Lazarus being raised from the dead, which seems a wee bit close to home in this time of global pandemic. One of the lines that really stood out for me in this Sunday's Gospel is when Martha says to Jesus, Lord, if you had been here, my brother wouldn't have died. How many times have we asked similar, if only, questions of God? Especially now when many people the world over might be questioning, how could God have allowed the world to get in such a state? Lord, if only you'd been here, these tens of thousands of people would not have died. But then we have Jesus' statement, I am the resurrection and the life. Whoever believes in me, even if they die, will live. And everyone who lives and believes in me will never die. Do you believe this? This is the key question, I think. Jesus isn't just asking it of Martha. He's asking us too. Do we believe that Jesus is the resurrection and the life? Do we have faith in God, no matter what happens to us and to the world? So as we head into the fifth week of Lent, let's all try and keep Jesus' powerful words in our heart. So that despite the fear, grief and uncertainty we might be feeling at this time, we can say confidently, just as Martha did, Yes, Lord, I believe.